This is a video about using Microsoft Excel 2010 to uh, create an equipment database. And this is part seven using a template. Uh, this is the spreadsheet we've been working with. What I'm going to do here is just delete the sample uh, data that was put in here, just uh, straighten up the format a little bit. And then I'm going to save this as a template type file. One thing is, is we go into these sheets, and if you wanted to save a, make a template, uh, we just want to delete the data, but not the formulas. And so, room numbers, and extra codes, and if you see formulas up in the formula bar, then it's not something that you want to delete. And here you see we've got formulas. And number of fixtures. Okay. So that would be all that we really need. Uh, it's got a little damage during the work here. Let's clean up that format. And the fixture schedule. Again, data. Uh, not formulas. See the other stuff went away by itself, so we don't want to go deleting anything over this section. These are formulas. And then finally, this column. Again, I'm just going to swing up the format a little bit here. And then finally, the last sheet. And I'll just one, just format this heading up here a little bit. And we'll leave the rest of it as it is. Now, uh, here, this uh, line list is linked to another spreadsheet. And uh, so what I'm going to do is uh, open the, other, the line list spreadsheet. And so, just going to open that. And now, this has sample data in it, too. So I'm going to go and uh, delete the stuff. And this is all data. And now, when we go back to our working spreadsheet, you'll see that the uh, stuff on the lamp list has all been deleted. So this is basically uh, a starting file. And uh, this, as a template, will be saved at uh, drinfrastructure.com. So you can download this uh, whole thing as a template. So I'm going to go back here and Go to save as. And uh, so I'm going to save this as a template. And here uh, I'm just going to rename this as um, generic building. Now, what you do in using this is if you're doing different buildings or whatever, you would name this file after the particular building that you were working on. So then I'm going to save this as a uh, template. So the Excel template. Now this is automatically going to throw you off into uh, the uh, template uh, locations and that may be where you want to put it and for your Excel. But um, I'm going to put it back where it was. Now this, uh, when you do this and save this as a template, it's automatically going to put you in a uh, directory uh, in your local drive for reserve for uh, Microsoft templates. And so if you want to put it in another place, which you can, you can open a template from anywhere, but you would have to change the directory. So I'm going to go back to that same directory that we had uh, had this file saved in, and I'm going to save it you know, right back there. And this will be the file that you would be able to uh, download. Now we've saved that as a template file. I'm going to switch over to that lamp list. And I'm going to say this one, uh, as it's all blanked out the way that it is here, uh, that is with, with no sample data. And I'm just going to save this as it was because um, we don't want to, in this case, uh, change the name of the file because it's linked from the other spreadsheet.
So I'll just uh, save. And then this will be one of the two files that's available for uh, download. I'm going to move back to this template file and close it. And then open it. So here's my generic building template file. So this is what you would have when you open this template. And it's you want that a lamp list file to be in the same directory. And if I look here at my lamp list, it's all zeros. And if I switch back to this file, we go here, it's all zeros. And now I'll open also that lamp list file. Alright. And in here I'm just going to put a lamp code. switch back to our generic building template you see that it's linked right from that file so this is doing exactly you know what we wanted to do and so that would be uh, the conclusion download a template go to drinfrastructure.com